<laughs> Hi, everyone. I'm here today with Susie and Carmen, and the three of us are organizing a wonderful Crystal Bowl Sound Symposium in Lura on the 22nd of September. Um, before we start, I'd like to just acknowledge country. I'm, I'm here today on Darawal Wadi Wadi country down in the Illawarra, and I'd like to acknowledge the lands where all three of us are and where everybody who's listening today is on. So, um, Susie, can you talk about why a Crystal Bowl Symposium? Sure, Mignon. It just seemed as if the time was right. It's as we're moving into an, a new era, a new paradigm, really. It seemed that the crystal singing bowls have been supporting the unfolding of so many of us who are growing in awareness and a sense of wanting to have a stronger community. We're, we're seeking ways in which to enrich our spiritual lives as well as our own personal development. And I think the, the sense of community and wanting to connect not only uh, with our own inner wisdom but with others of a, of a like mind so that together we can really increase the, um, the palpable loving energy that many of us are feeling and send that far and wide out into the world and really the symposium that's what it's about it's about collaboration coming together for the benefit of all and it just seemed like the right time Mignon and we yes. all put up our hand didn't we and say yes we let's do it yeah. <laughs> we did well, well the, we had one a few years ago and it was such a huge success and yeah. you know, everybody really grew from it and loved it. So, yeah, I, I think um, it's time for us to come back again. And we've yes. particularly chosen the dates of the 22nd to the 24th of, of September. Carmen, do you want to talk a bit about why we chose those dates? Yeah. Um, every year, as we all know, in September the 21st, it's International Day of Peace. And we always like to do something to mark that day and to contribute to the great outpouring of peaceful vibrations that all the different worldwide projects are mm. into the world. Um, and so we wanted to focus on that time. And so even though it's not quite, we've just missed it by one day, but we still feel we're in the energy of the International yeah. Day of Peace. And actually on the Saturday night in the in the symposium, we're having a concert and we're going to live stream that concert. So it means yay. that not only, yay, not only the <laughs> of the retreat centre where we're holding the symposium, the participants of the symposium, but also uh, anyone in the community who wants to either watch at that time or even they can watch it later on our Facebook page uh, mm -hmm. can feel the benefit of um, a large number of crystal bowls and other instruments that we have coming on that day um, to help foster this beautiful, peaceful mm. energy that we crave so much in the world now. A peace concert. Yay! A live stream. Yeah. Yeah. And everyone, everyone participating, like we did last time, yeah. we found ways that every single person that attends can be an active participant in that concert and yeah. that's really the nature of the collaborative way in which you know we want to work as crystal sound therapists it it is something that we often do in isolation with a client or with a group so coming together as a um as a collective is really um it's a joy for all of us yeah so Mignon what are some of the things you're looking forward to on the weekend I'm yeah, I, I mean, we, we, we spoke earlier about how playing crystal bowls often is a solo activity. And for me, it's about this coming together with others that play the bowls. And um, <clears throat> last time, I think we were there for five days. And I, the effects of just having so many crystal bowl players and having those sounds run through my body, I was just on walking on clouds for for weeks afterwards because it was just so profound and so beautiful and what people brought as well was so unusual so I'm looking forward to seeing some of the workshops that people are bringing and also just that energy of so many people coming yes. together to 
play is yeah. just yeah that that co-creation of sound and 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 peace is really profound yes. how about you Carmen what are you looking forward to well, you know I am actually secretly looking forward to hearing all the new crystal bowls that Susie's just been in America choosing for the symposium yeah <laughs> so lots of new bowls coming into Australia and of course we've got our special golden symposium prize haven't we Susie so we have at the golden bowls. temple Yes, yeah. and we've actually bought um, a couple of brand new bowls, Ooh. and one is called Earth, Ooh. and um, another one is uh, well, I'll say that as a surprise. Yeah, right. <laughs> we've got a few surprises happening actually yeah. at the weekend. We've got yeah, yeah a couple of really um, big announcements, so I can't wait for that. Always have a surprise. What what are you most looking forward to, Susie? Do you know I'm I'm there's a couple of people that are actually going to share some personal experiences, um, and um, they're quite innovative. So I'm really looking forward to the uh, to those. And look, I always love a, a yin a yin yoga and crystal bowl session. You know, I don't get a chance to, to do that as much as I would like. So I'm really looking forward to that. And, of course, the concert is mm. always a, a wonderful highlight. Beautiful. So yeah. really, there's so much. Um, there's so much to look forward to in our power-packed two days. And Definitely. Two yeah. So thank you, everyone. And the links to how you can book for the Crystal Ball Silent Symposium are above on this video. And thank you, Susie and Carmen, for joining me today. And we're looking Oh, and you too, darling girl. <laughs> for creating this amazing thing. It's a little bubble of joy. <laughs> and we'll be seeing you in a few weeks, everyone. See you yeah. in September. God bless. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.